pH is a measure of how acidic or alkaline a soil is. The more hydrogen ions in the soil, the more acidic it is. The more hydroxyl ions in the soil, the more alkaline it is. Agriculture can change the pH of soil. Ammonium-based fertilisers, urea, or the urea from the urine of animals can acidify the soil in the longer term. The transformation of ammonium to nitrite to nitrate releases hydrogen ions into the soil, resulting in the soil becoming more acidic. Nitrate leaching, where nitrate moves below the root zone and cannot be used by plants, is a significant source of agricultural acidification. Soil can also acidify if the ammonium produced by nitrogen-fixing bacteria, rhizobia, living in the nodules on legume roots is not all used by the crop or pasture. Agriculture can also accelerate acidification by removing alkaline products such as wool, milk, cereal grain, legumes and hay. The reverse is also true, where the introduction of manure, decaying animals, silage and stock feeds can add alkalinity back into the soil. The build-up of this organic matter with its organic acids can acidify the soil as carboxylate function groups dissociate and release hydrogen ions. One way to combat acidification is to apply lime to the soil. Liming soil raises soil pH by consuming hydrogen ions. A major constraint to plant production on strongly acid soils can be aluminium toxicity and manganese toxicity. Both are more soluble at low pH. For example, aluminium dissolves into the soil solution as aluminium that is taken up by the plant, causing root deformation and stunted plant growth. If a soil continues to acidify until it becomes very strongly acidic, Biological activity, soil structure and nutrient toxicity or deficiency can become significant challenges to productive agriculture.